If you're a Photoshop user and you picked up this laptop with eight gigs of RAM, it's definitely worth upgrading it to 16 gigs of RAM. Now, if you have it with eight gigs of RAM, you're gonna get a Photoshop benchmark score from Puget Systems of 437. If you simply make the upgrade to 16 gigs of RAM dual channel, you'll get 631 points on the Photoshop benchmark. Now, the only reason to upgrade past 16 gigs of RAM is if you're gonna go all the way up to 64. And the reason being is the jump from 16 gigs to 32 gigs is only about 60 points. But the jump from 16 gigs to 64 gigs is 100 points. So making that jump from 16 to 32 really doesn't make that much sense. Now, to actually upgrade once you get all of the top cover and safety plate off is really simple. You just pull, ooh, see how simple it is? It literally popped right out. You just pull that off and these slide right out. And then you can replace them with the modules that you purchased. These are from Team Group. These are the T-Create RAM modules. They're fantastic, they're well-priced, and you get a limited lifetime warranty. So if these ever bug out on you or for some reason crap out, and obviously you didn't like smash it with a hammer, they will take care of you in getting these replaced. So you just slide those right back in there, pop them in, stick your fingers, and you are good to go. You got brand new RAM in your laptop. Now, the difficulty. Taking this laptop apart was more difficult than any laptop I'd messed with before. The reason being is these hidden screws, you have to remove these rubber feet off the bottom cover of your laptop, which then reveals four main screws, which will allow you to remove it from the chassis. Also, the little clips that secure the bottom cover to the chassis before you can actually pull it off are a little brittle. I actually broke one of them when I was taking it off. So do be careful if you do decide to upgrade this laptop. HP even recommends not, and I think it's because, well, it's kind of difficult. From there, you actually have to end up taking off this safety plate, which was also kind of difficult. Now, I'm not saying this can't be done. It definitely can be done. And I'm gonna link up HP's actual video that shows you how to do it because it's a very, very good video. Um, and so if you wanna upgrade it, I think it's a great idea, especially if you're a Photoshop user, it will give you more performance, especially if you're going from eight gigs to 16 gigs or even 16 to 64, if you just wanna get a little more juice out of your laptop. Overall, in regards to upgrading this laptop, I say approach it at your own risk. It was rather difficult. You could possibly tear these or, or miss or lose the sticky, which then they wouldn't go back on nicely. And so it's just a bit of a difficult laptop. Take it at your own risk. But if you feel like you can do it, then I believe in you. Links if you're ready to make a purchase, likes if this video has brought you some value, and subs if you don't want to miss out on the future uploads. I'll see you in the next video.